the outstanding wrestler Basak Kudikov, a promising athlete, whose life was tragically cut short at the age of 27. He dreamed of an Olympic gold medal, having already won a bronze and silver at the Olympic Games. He had all the chances for this triumph, but it didn't happen. The destiny did not give the wrestler an opportunity to win Olympic gold. Basak Kudikov was born in August 1986. The first years of his life were spent in a small accession village of Tskiloni. Then parents moved to the city of Beslan. From the age of nine the boy began to be interested in sports, visited various sections. However, most of all he liked freestyle wrestling, which subsequently he decided to stop. Basak gladly attended training sessions, where he gave his best and was easily spurred even with older competitors. At the first all-round competitions, Kudikov began to take part in the last years of school, and the first significant success he reached in 2003, winning the European Cadets Championship. That's when many experts began to talk about the possibility of a successful sporting future. Two years later the young wrestler was noticed in the Federation and invited him to the selection in the national team of Russia. Kudikov with success passed all tests, and already was numbered in the list of national athletes. And in the same year at the World Championship among juniors he became the first, having bypassed all his opponents. In 2006 Basak Kudikov took part in the Championship of Russia and showed the best result again, due to which he received a ticket to the World Championship. However, to win the World Championship, he lacked only a few points. Then, in the finals of the tournament in the category up to 55 kilograms, he lost to the Bulgarian Radoslav Falikov. But the year 2007 became golden for Kudikov. He won on almost all the tournaments he participated in, thus securing the trip to Beijing 2008 Olympic Games. He was going to the Games with one goal in mind, to be the champion. But his debut appearance at the Olympics brought him only a bronze medal, which greatly enraged him. He was confident that at the next Olympics, he would be able to achieve more, so he started training harder. In 2009 he changed his weight class and started to compete at under 60 kg. It did not take him long to adapt and already at this year's world championship he won another world gold, in the final fight confidently defeating Zelimkin Gusinov of Azerbaijan. At the 2010 world championships in Moscow Kudikov fought very confidently and did not give any chances to his opponents. Only in the final Vesely Federation from Ukraine competed against him, but he also could not defeat him on his way to the next gold medal. The next year the situation was the same again. By this time Kudikov, who already had a great experience of top-level performances, won his fourth world title. In brilliant style he made it to the final and defeated Franklin Gomez of Puerto Rico. And now Basak Kudikov became the country's unqualified hope to win gold at the next Olympics in 2012. Many were 100% sure this guy would be an Olympic champion. At the 2012 Olympics, with each new round Basak was increasingly proving his superiority over his opponents and increasing his chances of winning the championship. He confidently reached the final, where the real drama unfolded. The heat of passion was so great that people tried not even to think about the possibility of losing. But, very unexpectedly, both for himself and for the Russian fans, Kudikov lost to Togrel Astero from Azerbaijan. Basak Kudikov was offended. After all the silver is not what he expected, but he could not change anything. The only thing left to hope for was the next competition, but these dreams were not destined to come true. The life of the wrestler was tragically cut short. Basak Kudikov died as a result of a car accident that occurred on December 29, 2013.